Hello friends, welcome back to Biotech Simplified. Today, we will discuss about another interesting topic which is immunosurgery. So what is immunosurgery? Immunosurgery is a technique that is being used to remove the sona pellucida of the blastocyst. In order to dissolve the sona pellucida, the blastocyst is either treated with pronase or an acid triode solution. So apart from the pronase or the acid triode solution, we also need an antiserum as well as a complement. So the antiserum used is rapid anti mouse serum whereas the complement used is guinea pig complement serum. So first, the blastocyst is treated with a pronase or an acid triod solution. It is pre-incubated with an anti-serum, which is a rabbit anti-mouse serum. Third is the exposure to the complement, that is the guinea pig complement serum. So these three steps results in the cytotoxicity that is it results in the killing or the breakage of tropoblast. So as the tropoblast layer gets broken the ICM that is inner cell mass becomes easier to isolate. So by using an immunosurgery we can isolate the ICM that is inner cell mar very easily. Now let us describe the procedure of immunosurgery with the help of a diagram. So the first diagram shows a blastocyst. A blastocyst consists of tropoblast as well as the inner cell mass. So by using an immunosurgery, the main aim of our purpose of immunosurgery is to isolate the ICM, that is inner cell mass. So our aim is to isolate the inner cell mass. So for this purpose, we add acid triode solution or pronose. So now let us look at the second diagram. So in this diagram, you can see that antibodies are attached to the tropoblast. So the antiserum used is either rabid anti-human or rabid anti-mouse antiserum. So here the antibodies are attached to the tropoblast. After incubating it with an antiserum, it is then washed and exposed with a complement. So as you can see in the third diagram, the red color dots represents the complement. So it is exposed to the complements and this results in breaking of the tropoblast layer. So as you can see, the blue color which is the tropoblast is broken in third step. And this results in breaking and the remaining inner cell mass is being exposed. So here by using an immunosurgery, we can isolate the inner cell mass. So now let us have a look on the microscopic images of immunosurgery. So the A diagram, that is the first diagram is the diagram which is taken before immunosurgery, that is, it is the blastocyst which consists of tropoblast as well as the inner cell mass. So the B diagram is when it is treated with an acid triode and it is pre-incubated with an antiserum as well as it is exposed with a complement. So the B is when the B image is taken when the procedures are carried out. So C, that is the last diagram, is taken after the immunosurgery is happened. That is, the tropoblast layer is being dissolved by the procedure. 
so the resultant is the inner cell mass icm so in this way that is by using immunosurgery we can isolate icm hope the concept is clear for more such videos do subscribe to our channel biotech simplified